Good morning, you guys. This morning we are at Holland Law View Rehabilitation Hospital. We, I am here with Gracie, and she has a doctor's appointment. We are going to see the orthotics doctor. Gracie, she had the cast. It really worked well, but not enough. So we are going to see the doctor to find out if we should continue with another round of casting or if we should, if she's going to need surgery. But I think at this point it might be surgery. I am not sure, but yeah, this is, this is us this morning. I'm gonna take Gracie because Gracie's hitting herself. I'm gonna go get her. There are times she does it, you guys, and there are times she does not do it. I don't know what happened this morning. You wanna say hi? Look. Hi. There are times she does it, there are times she doesn't do it. She mostly doesn't do it, but this morning she was going. What happened? Hmm? <laughs> yes, yeah, so I am gonna take Gracie in her appointment is at 11 30 we are quite early i think it's about 11 o'clock now i'm gonna go register her and then take her on the floor hi you guys i am just sitting here editing this video and just realized that i did not complete the video so i took gracie to holland blowview rehabilitation hospital um they had to check her leg her right leg more because we did the casting it worked to an extent but gracie's leg is still very tight the muscles behind the right leg is so tight we had gotten some gains but that didn't last that long it has gotten so tight and she was referred to the orthotics doctor at holland Blorview. we went she got assessed and he said Doing another set of casting will not benefit Gracie. Even if we were to do it with Botox, she would not get benefit from that. Reason being is because Gracie's muscles are so tight. It's not only behind her leg, below the knee, but also in her thigh. The muscle there is very tight. Sorry, you guys, my husband is unlocking the door. The muscle there is very tight and she will need surgery. Um, I, I knew that eventually Gracie would have to have surgery and hearing that I am not surprised. We will not do another round of casting for Grace cause the gains will not last. She will not benefit from it. We would have to find funding or pay it out of our pocket and she will not get benefit. So it will be a waste of money. So he said, as long as Gracie can walk for now without any pain, without, you know, any complications, Gracie can carry on for now for another year or two or three because she is still growing and in the event that something happens let's say gracie is having pain she cannot walk with the afos um she is not able to stand and, and to do the things that she's doing now i would have to call him back and then he would have to reassess gracie and if she needs surgery at that time we would go ahead and do the surgery which i agree with but for now because she can walk with the afos um, she's in school right now and she's wearing her EFOs because it's kind of like Gracie's wearing heels. She is able to wear that for now. She's able to walk with it. Last week, I, 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 I saw Gracie as if she, I'm not too sure. So I, I can't say she didn't want to put her right leg down, she, her right foot down. Sorry. She did not want to walk. So she was putting it on top of the left leg and standing kind of like a flamingo so i'm not sure if gracie just didn't want to stand or if she was having pain but i will continue to watch her but for now i am not sure what is going on i will continue monitoring gracie and i would have to call the doctor again and then he will have to reassess her and then he will make the decision whether or not gracie needs surgery right now and if that's what's going on with gracie if that's what she needs then we will go ahead and do the surgery for grace 
maybe if we do it now, she might have to have another one in the future. I am so praying that she will not have to have another one in the future, but I don't know. So if you guys have gone through this or you know someone who's gone through it and you guys would like to help me out with some information, comment in the comment section below. You guys can also find us on Facebook and Instagram at Grace's Journey and God's Faithfulness. You guys can DM me. You guys can also email me and let me know what maybe what to expect what you guys have gone through what are some of the complications you know i don't know you guys i'm a mom and i would love to know some of these things i would love to know what to expect how to prepare for her surgery because to me the more informed you are the better equipped you are and i will be able to handle whatever is coming much better um, for sure, Gracie will need surgery. When exactly, we're not sure. The gain that she did get from the, the serial cast, casting, um, she's lost it. So we will see. Her serial casting is not in the books for her right now, but surgery is. I just want to say thank you guys for the support and the love that you guys have given us. And to our new subscribers, thank you guys so much for subscribing to our channels. And if you're new here watching our videos, please do consider subscribing to our channel. Help us grow this channel. Help us reach 1K subscribers. And share with your friends. Share with your family members. You know, share on your social media um, groups. I don't mind you sharing. I would be very happy if you guys would share and Let's come together. Let's create a community. Let's share. I'm a mom of an eight-year-old who has trisomy 18. You have any questions? Leave your questions in the in the comment section below. I will answer your questions. Maybe one of these days I can even do a live and we can chat. We can talk. But I want to see you guys commenting in the comment section below. Show the interest so that I can do a live stream where we can chat i think that would be awesome i would love 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 to do that so let me know what you guys think let me know if you guys are interested in that and until next time take care of yourselves and your loved ones